Hello, my name is Trilton and I'm gonna show you a different way on how to make dialogues for custom NPC smart. So, what are we gonna use? Well, we are gonna use something called the external dialogue editor. Since I am on 1.8.9, I'm gonna download this one for 1.710c and higher. Once you have downloaded it, I'm just gonna put it on the desktop because that's the most easy way to find it. And since I'm gonna use it a lot, this is the best place just to have it. Right. Now, right click it. You can double click it. If it doesn't work, you need to right click it and then open with Java. There it is. It's nothing fancy, it looks like this. Okay, now what? Now go to file, go to load, and then find the dialogues folder. You don't need to find a dat file or a, a Excel file or anything like that, but just a dialogues folder. Now it goes into regular Minecraft folder. I don't have anything in here. So I'm gonna use uh, the folder I'm gonna use in here. There it is. Locate your custom PC folder inside your Minecraft folder. There's a custom PC folder. You can see your saves and everything here. Locate your saves. I want to go into one called New World. Double click it. There is a new custom PC folder inside your save world. Double click it. Dialog folder. Select it. Open. Now, this is how it looks like, and this is a standard dialog which is in the mod already. But exactly, what does it do? Well, you see this NPC I created? I'm calling in the Valeron. It's not talking to me right now. And that is mainly because if you remember my last tutorial, you have to go into advanced into lines, interact lines, and remove this line first. Now we're gonna make him talk, but I'm not gonna do anything in game. We are gonna use it in the dialogue editor. And I'm gonna show you that now. We're gonna make a new one. Select root, add. This is the name of your character. Let's say it's Bob for you, but I have Valeron. It doesn't need to be his name because you can rename it in game, so it doesn't really matter. But for me or for you, whatever you want, it's better to maybe make the name for the character you're gonna use. Right, then add again. That's his dialogue. Add again. That's his dialogue. He's gonna say one thing. I'm gonna say one thing. He's gonna say one thing. I'm gonna say one thing. But now these are just his dialogues, so you should mark this first and then add again, talk. Now this will be your dialogue, and then if you click this, and you add, talk. So here can be, this could be the, hello, and this can be, I'm fine. So here he will say, this will be the starting dialogue. But he doesn't say anything, this is just the name of the starting dialogue. So here is a text, you see this? Here's text. Hello. How are you today? This is what he's gonna tell me. So then I go to my this, where I'm gonna talk back. Erase this. I'm fine, how are you? Then, this is going to stay quit over here, position, we're just going to use this one option and then select dialogue and then select ID 13 because that's the dialogue number we are going to answer him to. So he says I'm fine. Thanks. And then I can say that's good. 
and then quit because I'm not gonna answer him back. So this should be redirected to this one. And this is the quit. There's no save anything here. You just push exit. Now it should be saved because you already loaded the world up. Okay, now what? He's ready. I click him, nothing happens. He just looks at me. Put out your wand. Go into. If you go into global and dialogues, you will see he's already in here. If you go to dialogues, select option. Volera. That's the one, I think. No, it isn't. I think it's made a new one. Yes, hello. Select. That's it. And if I just right click him now. Hello, how are you today? I'm fine, how are you? I'm fine, thanks. That's good. So, okay, how do you do it again? You have to close the world you're gonna use. Don't have it open. But you don't need to close Minecraft. The villager example can be removed inside the game here, but I think it will come back again, so just let it be. Mark root, do add. This will be in the category for your custom NPC. I'll just call him Valeron. Then, right, there's nothing more else here, so you just can only do this remove, add, or copy. Well, do add. That's his dialogue. Here you can rename what the dialogue is going to be called, for example, hello, or goodbye, or something, and then the text here. But you want to talk to him back, just keep this one marked, then add talk. That's where you talk back. So if you go back to him, we can call not new, but uh, hello, or greetings. Let's do greetings, greetings. Then he says, hello there. And I say, of course, also. Hello. Now, if this is going to be just, a cl just what we're going to say, he's going to say hello and me hello or greetings, then this should stay to quit. But if you want the dialogue to become any f farther longer, or just a longer dialogue, you go back to greetings, right click, you do add. No, I get talk again. I shouldn't have talk. Go back to Valera, I mean, and do add. Sorry. Now, this will be his new, and if you do add here, the ship is now four. But you can also do, if you do want to do it easier, you can just mark his f folder and do add, 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 and then do the talks after a while. Okay, so he says greetings, I say hello, and then he can say, yeah. How are you? And then I will say I'm fine, thanks. Now this is quit, so it shouldn't be quit. It should be related to the dialogue, yes? So it has to be related to the next dialogue in line, which is number ten. This is number 9, this is number 10. So I'm gonna do dialogue, and I'm gonna fix it and say number 10. Because this will be the close one. So, greetings, text, talk, rename what you want, hello, type dialogue, ID, because we'll go back to, we'll go to the next one, this one. Here we say, how are you? I will answer back, I'm fine, thanks. It doesn't need any dialogue here because we're not going to go any further. Just quit. Now go to exit. Should be saved. Back in game. Just quit the game and ex then do go into the editor if you want to make more texts. Just don't quit Minecraft. You don't need that. It's so easy to use. Okay. Close the NPC. I right click him. Nothing happens. Put out your wand. Go into advanced, not global, but advanced. Go into dialogues, select option, and find 
Valeran. These new ones, I don't know what these are here, it has to be something with old save, but just select it, select the greetings. Don't want to select this one, select, then you're done. If I click him now, hello there, hello. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. End. So that's it. It's uh, quite a nice dialogue editor. You can also change dialogues, of course, in the game if they don't look right in the dialogue window. But sometimes, if you write the dialogues, the text can be a little bit misplaced. So you have a lot more space between the letters. But you can fix that in game. So I hope this has helped. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. Put that like button and also don't forget to subscribe. See ya, bye bye.